How to be an appointment setting machine. Hi, I'm Paul R. Atkinson, your real estate coach. Today, I'm going to talk to you and show you some important tips on how to be an appointment setting machine. Yes. Before we get started, be sure to hit the subscribe button and do remember to go into the description section of this video to see my gift to you on how to be an appointment setting machine. All right. So what do you think about when you hear that machine man, appointment setting machine robot? No, you want to be a person that have drive and dedication and the tenacity of a bulldog to just make sure that your calendar is stacked ram pack every day. There's two things you need to be an appointment setting machine. Here's what you need. Number one, you need a calendar. You need to work on a calendar, right? When I first started out many years ago, you know, we carried this big old eight by 11, uh, daily planner. Those days are done. Right. And I enjoy that, but Hey, it was pretty cool. You know, sophisticated, you got your briefcase and you know, you've got your eight by 11, uh, daily planner. You need a calendar. You want to be an appointment setting machine. You need to have a daily calendar on that calendar. You are going to plan for the days. Every day is going to have a plan. When you first start out this way and you keep working it and working it, working it, everything just get filled up. Everything just get filled up. So you have to have your planner. You have to have some kind of calendar today. It's like your device. You know, it's like we all have like a, a, a cell phone, right? And we're carrying it around. Check in there. You have like Google calendar that synchronizes with everything. When your staff looks at, or your assistant looks at your calendar, they could help you as you become a top producer, because you know what? You're going to need that leverage. You're going to need to leverage your time with so many things. When a hundred phone calls are coming in practice. Now, if you're not already, you need to use a calendar. Look in your device. You have like two, if you have that iPhone, guess what? It has a calendar already. If you have a, uh, Android system, has a calendar already. I recommend using the Google calendar. Everybody has a Gmail account. So look at that and link up because it's going to allow you to synchronize very easily and share your calendar with someone that can help you to run your calendar. So the number one thing in being that appointment setting machine is to have a calendar. What's number two, simple work, the calendar. You have to work the heck out of that calendar. And that means every day before you lay down that night, you just take a quick look. This is what you do. You know how you go to set the alarm to wake up the next day. You know, that movement you got, Oh, what time I need to, you know, we do that, right? Most of us like, Oh, what I have to get up and get the kids. You remember that movement? You know, that movement, it becomes so robotic for you right now. Add something to that movement. And what it's called is, what is on my calendar for tomorrow? What do I have? Where do I start? Look. And when you start to pay attention to that and you see that you have boom, a listing appointment at nine or 10 or whatever. Then after that, I plan that I'm going to make some phone calls or I'm going to do some, uh, door knocks. Then I'm going to have some lunch with my center of influence. Then I'm going to have this. And then I'm going to do that. And that. You need to work that calendar. When you start to work these things, it will allow you to be a machine at just having appointments, appointments after appointments. The main thing for you to get appointments is to create a list that I like to tell you about. That's called the income generating ideas. So here's what you do. You get a blank sheet of paper, eight by 11, right in the top on the center. You can type it in or write it big marker and it's called I. G a income generating ideas. I G a income generating ideas. <laughs> Put a line onto that. And from now, from this moment forward, I want you to start making that list. You need to create this list and have it by your desk, by your bedside, in the bathroom, by the mirror. Mm hmm. I'm writing your prescription. You ready? The prescription says income generating idea list is standing 
by your bed. As soon as you come out of the bed in the morning, there's a list right in front of you right there of all these things that you're going to accumulate right now. You need to accumulate it because that's how you're going to be the appointment setting machine. Then next to you in the mirror, when you brush your teeth and do stuff, that list is kind of like right there. You can make it fancy, do whatever you want, or just handwrite it. doesn't matter. It works the same. And next to your desk where you work, it's the same list, three places. So on that list, income generating ideas, Think about it. What activity could I do today that's going to generate income for me? Oh, there you go. I learned this thing years ago. And that is what allows me and you to be able to make appointments like a machine. When you list those items, call 50 people today. Well, that's a bit much, but if you want to do it, that's good. And if you can do it, it's fine. There's a dialer and things like that. You could do that, but call 50 people today. Contact 10 people physically today. That when you set tasks like that as income generating ideas, it's just things that you could put on your calendar. When there's nothing to put on a calendar, you could jot that in one hour, contact 10 people today. What does that mean? It means that you're going to contact 10 people that you really don't know. Or even if you do know, when you say that psychologically to yourself and you get up and you say, okay, I'm going to contact 10 people. Well, all right. All right. Okay. I'm set out today on a journey to contact 10 people. I'm going to Starbucks. Let me grab a coffee on my way to the office, put my name badge on, go into Starbucks in my mind. I need 10 people today. So I'm standing, uh, let me have the mocha latte, whatever, make your order. And you're standing waiting and you know, Somebody just looks at you, but you remember you have that name badge on that says you're a real estate agent and it's blingy, right? Or you just look professional, whatever it is. You just draw attention to you, right? Just eye contact. Just, just look at me. You don't want to look at me. You look at me, I'm going to talk to you. Hey, and they look at you be like, oh, wow, nice day today, right? Oh, yes, yeah, nice day. Yeah, oh, wow. You're, I always see you here. What do you get? Oh, you get the mocha. Oh, yeah, I get the same thing. Man, it's so good. I just start to chat. Next thing you know, I could link up, I could connect, and that's one down for the day. And I go through the day just like that. Income generating ideas, work your calendar. Make sure you have activities on that calendar. It goes on and on and on. Go in the description box below, click on the link to get my full list on more income generating ideas that you can put on your list. Remember, eight by 11 piece of paper, income generating ideas, IGA, and start making your list. Just creating that list. Be that appointment set in machine that you ought to be as a real estate agent, as that business owner, as that entrepreneur, make those appointments, get those listings and get those buyers closed until next time. I will see you soon. You know what I always say, guys, go get them tiger. <laughs>